Hey friend, you are back with the Aries Alchemist for another general tarot reading. And this is for Gemini. So if you're a Gemini, sun, moon, or rising, something in this is for you. You have the Nine of Pentacles in reverse, the King of Wands in reverse. The Eight of Pentacles in reverse. The Magician. The Wheel. And the Ace of Wands. I'll clarify those and then we'll get into what they mean. Okay, we have the Nine of Pentacles in reverse, clarified by the Page of Cups in reverse. So you're feeling like things are just completely falling apart in all areas of your life right now. It's the energy that I'm getting. King of Wands in reverse, clarified by the Nine of Pentacles. You feel like the people around you are just not honest and that some of them even set you up for failure. Eight of Pentacles in reverse, clarified by the Tower for some of you, I'm hearing is that you lost your job or you lost a client, something that's going to affect the bottom line of your household and you feel like it's not your fault or that this isn't something you deserve. Magician clarified by the page of swords in reverse. Spirit is saying you're just thinking about this all wrong. You're going into a lot of negative self-talk and it's pretty much just making you paranoid. There's different signs for you to be looking for right now. And I think that's going to be your title. You got the will clarified by the page of wands in reverse. Once you get over this emotional hump, you'll see that the fact that this happened actually opens you up for a lot of better opportunities than you had before. Page of Wands clarified, or I'm sorry, the Ace of Wands clarified by the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Also, whatever it is that you'll be doing next, you won't even need anybody else's help for it. So it's something that you can start right away once you figure out what it is that you really want to do. So although you don't feel good, things are going really well for you. Just not the way that you wanted them to go. If you were to carry around some crystals, which ones would help you most? Emerald and blue kyanite. These will both help you to cleanse and align all of your chakras and heal that emotional part of you. So getting both of these and sleeping with them under your pillow as well as carrying them around in your pocket is really going to help you turn things around. Something from your guardian angels via the moon deck. You have believe in the impossible and you are good enough. There's no request that's too big or too small for the universe. Whatever you really want to happen, as long as you believe that it's yours now, it will come to you. Period. And that goes for anybody in any situation. We just usually have more contradictory beliefs than we realize. So there's too much conflict for what we want to come into fruition. But we're going to end this with the Cannabis Oracle and you have the devil and it says let go of what you think is yours or what holds you back. Be clear and it'll set you free. This is encouraging you to focus solely on what it is you want to happen next because wherever you put your focus is what's going to grow. And that's what I have for you guys. If anything resonated, please like, comment, share and subscribe to the channel. I go through the entire Zodiac at least once a week. And if you have questions about anything that I said or literally anything else, you can book a reading with me through the link in the description box. All right, y'all. Peace.